So here we have um, the rendering um, for the phase two construction. Um, if you look to your far left, you'll see um, the exterior of the corner building from Robinson and Paris Street. Uh, really wanting to um, show the corner front as a warm and inviting space. But, you know, a lot of folks don't necessarily know what this building is. So adding uh, visible signage, visible descriptions of um, the corner, um, as you can see here. Um, and then to your, your right here, you can see uh, the view of the corner cafe um, from, the, from Robinson Street. Um, so just really wanting to add some additional um, seating area here, um, having a warm and inviting space, um, you know, working with Jeff and Sarah to add some uh, artwork because that will still remain to be a priority for us to engage artists um, that would be and have art that would be available for sale for people that come in. As you can see at the bottom here, um, or in both images, you can see the steps that lead to the community one side. So really wanting to open up this area so that you can access both spaces um, so that there would be just like even flow between the two instead of having to go outside. Um, in this image here, uh, this shows what the new addition would look like from Terrace Street. Um, it really is a goal of ours to activate this parking area that's located in the back, making it a, another inviting space for music performances. Um, and this can also be, you know, just some seating here for the cafe um, and just having a place for children to be also um, invited and welcome to even utilize this space too, which I think is very important. Um, this image here, you can see the interior of the community room where we're sitting now. Um, so there would be some additional overflow seating for the cafe. But we also wanted to show what the space will look like with various programming happening here because it will continue to be a multi-purpose space. So we would have our youth programs also have on the lower right um, an image of the community space set up for a music performance or events continuing to center the art. Um, and then also making sure that this space would be available for rental reservations for folks in the community to be able to utilize themselves. We've had birthday parties here, uh, baby showers, graduation parties, um, which you can actually still host <laughs> um, in this space really making sure that this is a space for communities to be able to use for their own personal programs and events. So we do have an image here of what the cafe serving counter will look like. Um, and then we also have the cafe prep area here. Um, just thinking about some of the guidelines with the Allegheny Health Department, um, having you know a, a prep area with proper refrigeration, which will really open us up to have uh, a menu that will offer um, you know, a wide array of, of items compared to when we first started. Um, these images here also show what uh, we are looking to have for the office space. Um, there will be an office located on the mezzanine level, as well as an office located on the second floor. And as you continue on, we have images of what the addition, um, what the entrance from Paris Street will look like, which will include, as Jeff um, shared, uh, it will include a lift that will take you to the mezzanine level and the second level, um, as well as, as steps that will take you out to the side of the cafe serving counter. And then we have ADA accessible restrooms, which is a huge need here. Um, currently, our restrooms as a temporary fix is located in the, in the basement. So we did create an x-ray view of the program spaces. So with this view, you can see the entrance from uh, what is currently the parking area. We're looking to have a small um, room here that may have some cafe storage opportunities, but also a big need. We don't have a space to like really receive mail and packages for the corner, um, for corner staff and for tenants. Um, and then we also have steps here that lead to the mezzanine level. Um, if I come back down here, you would be able to access the lift that would take you to both um, the mezzanine and this upper floor. Um, there's an additional office space here. This view shows you where the restroom would be located. 
Um, and then as I continue up the stairway, we have the entrances to the corner apartments, to the two bedroom and the three bedroom part, apartment. And with this lift, it will really um, allow us to hire um, and just broaden our ability to hire staff and have tenants that may need certain ADA accessible um, accommodations, which is very important. 